This is a very difficult video to make because it's such a sad subject and such a traumatic era in history as well. In 1939, the Germans invaded Poland and moved the Jews to an area of lots they called Lismanstadt. And what you're seeing here is the ghetto which existed until 1944. In the spring of 1944, the Nazis closed the ghetto down and moved the Jews to Chumno extermination camp and Auschwitz-Birkenau. During their time in the ghetto, they were forced to use special money. This was the original money. And you can see this 10 Fenix looks a little bit too close to the German equivalent. So it didn't last very long and they swapped it out for something that looked slightly different. Most of the money you can see here was made of aluminium or a combination of aluminium and magnesium. Here's the money that was used in 1943 and this is the money that was used in 1942. Some patterns of this money were made in bronze and that leads us into today's arrival which was uh, something that I purchased from an Italian auction. So, uh, you know, and I felt it was historically very um, interesting and significant, as well as something which was um, extremely rare. And, uh, and I wanted to make this video into something which was a little bit of a special video and show you guys a little bit of the story of the horrific history that relates to the Lotz Ghetto, Lismannstadt, and that terrible, terrible era in history. So uh, this coin came in. It, uh, it was an auction win. Um, not very much competition for this coin, unfortunately. But this is a bronze version of the 10 Fenix coin from 1942. Um, I suspect a very few of these were circulated in the ghetto. Uh, there aren't very many of these that have surfaced. Almost all of them are in aluminium. So this one is a particularly special coin. Maybe it was a pattern coin. Uh, maybe it was a coin that was in the collection of one of the Jews who were in control of the inside of the ghetto. I don't really know the history of it. And if any of you guys know more of the history, please do comment and let everybody know. Or if you have any particular memories or your family has any memories of the Lot's ghetto, I think it would be really interesting to... Uh, to uh, hear those memories, although since almost all of the people in the ghetto were exterminated by the Germans uh, in extermination camps, um, most people don't really have many stories to tell of this particular very sad era. <laughs> 